what's going on guys today we are going to configure vs code for python development so for that we have to have a python install in our system and vs code also so let's do it go to any browser and search python and go to python.org and go to download and uh, this is the latest version of python so download python 3.12.2 depending upon your system uh, you can choose linux or max or uh, whatever operating system you are using save that it will take some time depending upon your internet speed now after uh, finishing download open that installer and then click on install now or customize installation and here there is two options use admin privilege when installing py.exe and add python.exe to path so that you don't need to go to environment variable and edit that environment variable and i'm going to show you edit environment variable variable and path edit you don't have to do all that here already give that option here add python.exe to path so install and our setup was successful close now to check whether python is installed in our system or not go to command and then type pythu and python that you can see python 3.1.2 is installed and here hello world there you go let's install bs code also so open up any browser and download bs code so go to browser and search bs code and then go to that first link that appeared in your search engine and then depending upon your environment or operating system whatever you are using download that corresponding visual studio code version i'm using windows so i'm going to install uh, either uh, you can install either user installer or system installer i'm going to use system installer uh, 64 x 64 not arm version it will automatically start downloading now uh, run that dot exe file that is downloaded in your system yes and accept the agreement and then click next visual studio code next and uh, by default add to path and register code is an editor for supported file system that two options are already selected um if you like other option like creating or desktop icon then you can select that option i'm not going to do that and install after installing launch click finish it will automatically launch bs code now it will ask you a couple of uh, question or it will ask you to choose the settings uh, when you install visual studio code for the very first time you can choose your themes dark high contrast light mode light modern dark modern i'm going to use that one and it support all our language that you can see and you can change your settings and sync setting across devices that means you have to log in through your account and unlock productivity with common palette and couple of more settings here and it has a lot of extension and it also has a built-in terminal install git customize your shortcut and mark done now what you need to do is uh, you need to source extension after uh, installing python in your system so go to extension section and search python here and uh, download that extension python python debugger python indentation and whatever you like it's saying it i don't know why but how uh, we install these two now uh, 
simply go and create one file like text file and save that hello.py and print hello from python save that now go to terminal and simply you can run that from here also here you can see hello from python so in this way you can configure visual studio code for python for software development and you can either write python script for your uh, project or use python for gui development also you have to use tk inter for that uh, stay connected with this channel because we are going to create a uh, python tutorials and python course uh, for you guys so so thank you for watching have a good day bye bye